he had his first psychotic break. That was very devastating. It was scary because we didn't know what was going on. It was scary for him. He was terrified, scary for us as a family. And that's when he was first hospitalized. This was about 16. We went on and off for about a year, in and out of hospitalizations with psychotic breaks because he was having episodes after episodes. And it was, he didn't know what was going on. And at first they just call it psychosis. And then I guess after a certain amount of episodes, they then gave the diagnosis of schizophrenia on top of the autism. When we finally had a diagnosis, they kept trying different medicines. A lot of the medicines would not work. They tried everything and he would still have so many symptoms, very symptomatic. It was scary for him and then he would come home and then have to go back to the hospital again. And he missed birthday, holidays. It was a very difficult time. As a parent, to see your child go through that, and he is such a wonderful child, to see your child suffering like that, it's the most heartbreaking thing. Um, it was very difficult. I was also pregnant at the time with mm. twins. And so it was really hard on my pregnancy, but I just made an effort. I wanted to get him better and get him help. That was my focus. That's all mm. I wanted to do.